Castlevania is going to be announced in E3 2023. What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Monkey Flop here, and today I know we're talking about Konami, and Konami is honestly not one of the favorite video game developers, especially because of what happened with Kojima. But they have been picking up steam in the video game news and i wanted to talk about it here today so uh fans have been theorizing that konami is working on a castlevania game after revealed that the publisher has trademarked the name project zycorn so project zycorn could honestly be literally anything but the fact that it's a jewel in Castlevania with the lowest currency value. Fans are speculating that we're going to get a new Castlevania game because it is code Zycorn. And the in-game currency is also named Zycorn. So a lot of people are, have been speculating that, uh, you know, Konami is up to... Uh, creating a new castlevania game we're honestly going to have to wait and see until uh, konami finally announces something we do know that they're going to be a big part of e3 e3 is kind of e3 has doesn't have E3 isn't going to have PlayStation. E3 isn't going to have Xbox. E3 isn't going to have Nintendo. It's going to have uh, video game developers mm -hmm. and a lot of indie developers as well. So there's not too much to look forward to. So I definitely get that, you know, uh, a lot of fans, including myself, are grasping onto the fact that Konami could be announcing Castlevania a new Castlevania game coming to the PlayStation 5. What are your thoughts on that? Let me know in those comments down below. We do know that Konami has been working on several different projects. Uh, we haven't heard really anything about uh, a Castlevania game, but we do know that they've been working on Silent Hill um, and a lot of their other franchise games as well. Uh, they're also working on an NFT project. Um... And a lot of people are speculating that this trademark has to do with something with the NFT that they're uh, currently working on. And I honestly don't know how many people would buy into, uh, you know, an NFT for Konami. But apparently somebody bought a $160,000 NFT Somebody actually bought. I'm I'm sorry if I'm pausing. I'm just having a hard time y thinking about the fact that somebody actually bought a hundred and sixty thousand dollar NFT for Konami. That is honestly mind blowing, in my personal opinion. Uh, you know, uh, NFTs, if you guys aren't familiar, familiar with what they are, I'm pretty sure some of you guys that are watching these videos know what NFTs are. So give us a brief description of what an NFT is in the video description down below. But I want to pass the question off to you. Do you think that Konami's actually working on a Castlevania game? Do you think that they're going to be bringing a new Castlevania game in 2023 on the PlayStation 5? How do you think it's going to play out? How do you think it's going to be different than the classic old school Castlevanias that we're used to? Let me know in those comments down below. If you guys are new, please subscribe with those bell notifications turned on. I bring you the latest and greatest in video game news and specifically playstation thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in the next news update you guys are freaking awesome